Exodus 23:25. Worship the hey, Lord your God, and his blessing will be on your food and water. I will take away sickness from among you. Can't tell you how good it feels to be back in Falls End. I'm glad you're looking to do more here. We need you. As you can see, John C's making a lot of people suffer right now, and quite frankly, I can't keep up. These people need me. They're my responsibility now. But that just means keeping tabs on the resistance is being that much harder. When you get a chance, head out east and check on our people at the Woods and Pig Farm. I haven't heard back from them in a couple of days, and that worries me. We can't afford to lose a single one of our fighters. Thank God you came along. All's in to see. Fire. No man put out this fire. 
the resistance. Those people are stronger today because of you. Just like the story of David and Goliath. You're inspiring real courage. Keep it up. Deputy, it's Mary May over in Falls End. Just wanted to say you're doing one hell of a job. But Eden's Gate aren't the type to just sit around with their thumbs up their butt. When we push, they push back harder. John's gonna send out everything he can to stop you. Helicopters, armed convoys, shit. Probably even the Chosen. The cult's elite soldiers. They're dangerous, Deputy. You keep your head on a swivel. Deputy, Deputy, listen up! We got a situation. Eden's Gate rolled out some monster they're calling the Revelator. It's a goddamn tank. They're trying to take the roads back. There's a resistance patrol sitting right in its path. They need help. You gotta hurry. <laughs>
need your help again. The folks you saved at Woodson's farm told me that the cult has a defector. He sought refuge with the resistance at the Silver Lake trailer park. But I've been in the dark ever since. There's no telling when the Lord will lift the burden of the wounded off my shoulders. Go to the Silver Lake trailer park and make sure that young man is safe and sound. We need to be open to forgiveness. If not, we're no better than the cult. Thought it'd take a miracle to survive. It is not for us to judge. Deliver them unto the waters. The cleansing begins tonight. Confess. 
Professor. Every sin you've ever committed, no matter how petty, no matter how small, I will pull from you. <laughs> then we'll see if you're worthy of atonement. Right away, we'll be okay, right? No. You'll make it worse. Why? Because confession without pain isn't confession. You'll scream out your sin, and you'll wear it on your flesh before John peels it off you. It's a beautiful thing. Fucking Peggy's. trouble just to lose you now. trouble when we couldn't reach you. I'm glad the Lord pointed me in the right direction. We got you back, but there's still others that need our help. Cult's moving the rest of the prisoners up the road. They got Merle, too. Time's wasting. Grab what you can and go save them. I'll call in some of our people. Evans! All right, I'm rolling! Watch my back! Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid of... as I was saying. Come here. I have a plan. 
sir. Good day to you. As I was saying, Colt's moving the rest of the prisoners up the road. They got Merle, too. Time's wasting. Grab what you can and go save them. I'll call in some of our people. We're gonna need them if we're gonna pull this off. Breathe in. Stay sharp. You got it. Here goes nothing. Run for it. Nineteen seventeen. How is it that one child won't How is it that the fat politician?
Deputy. I know you're looking for your friend, but Falls End was just a piece of the whole community that needs our help. Once we're strong enough, we'll free every last one of those prisoners. That's a promise. They really think they're saving us. Saving us! Locked up in a shithole? Those fucking cowards swore me. They said they were saving me. Told me to put my trust in the father. Who the fuck's the father anyway? They should have put a bullet in my head. I was pissed off. Now I'm fucking furious. 